Joelle Hanselin says it's taken her more than a year to drive past her former workplace without suffering a panic attack. I trained myself just to drive by and then diminish that physical reaction every single time. So I, I, I did that on my own just because I, I don't want it to, to win, let's just say. The workplace is the Royal Canadian Mint. Hanselin says she was subjected to racist comments during her eight years as a protective services officer. Then the joke started like, don't steal anything while I'm not home. Every year it got worse. Hanselin says she was constantly taunted by her colleagues, even supervisors, who asked if she went to school in a mud hut, whether her tattoos were gang affiliated. You just take it and you can just laugh around even though that's, it bothers you. Then, during a conversation about the primatologist Jane Goodall... I had one officer point at me and he said, chimpanzee, we work with one. That was my tipping point. Hanselin says she asked her colleagues to stop, but says things got worse once the new management had been made aware. I have never felt like more alone in my life. Hanselin says she also experienced sexual harassment at the Mint. Four other security employees spoke to CBC News on the condition they not be named. They corroborated a culture of racism and frequent unwanted touching. Well, I think that's wrong. I think, uh, you know what, they should feel safe at their workplace. But Hanselin said she didn't go to the union because she feared that might lead to further abuse. If people don't feel safe coming to their employer or their union, that's a big problem. The Mint says it launched an external investigation after Hanselin wrote to its president last summer. It's still awaiting that report, but says it plans to implement its recommendations. Olivia Stefanovic, CBC News, Ottawa.